According to defense analysts, Indian Army has plans to soon place orders for two Akash 1S regiments, approximately 2,000 missiles, worth over 14,000 crores or $2 billion. Akash 1S is a medium range surface to air missile with multiple target engagement capability and comes with an indigenously developed seeker for much more effective target engagement and kill zone. The Akash 1S is capable of striking down enemy fighter jets and drones very effectively and accurately. The Okash surface to air missile was designed to intercept enemy aircraft and missiles from a distance of 18 to 30 kilometers. Okash 1S system has been designed and developed for the Indian Army based on their requirements and will replace the vintage Soviet era SA 6 surface to air missile system. Indian Army already operates two Akash Mark I regiments which were recently in the news when the Indian Army moved in a few Akash Mark I surface to air missile systems close to Gowan Valley due to recent LAC standoff with PLA troops in the area. In the wake of multiple prolonged standoffs with the Chinese People's Liberation Army in Eastern Ladakh, India has conveyed to the US its renewed interest in the medium-altitude long-endurance armed Predator B drone. While India is operating Israeli hair and unarmed drones in eastern Ladakh, the acquisition of an armed drone has acquired urgency with China not only using Wing Long 2 armed drone but also in the process of supplying two systems to Pakistan. Although the US has offered to sell 30C Guardian for over $4 billion, national security planners feel that due to the prohibitive cost of the UAV it would be better to have an all-in-one drone rather than separate ones for surveillance and targeting. Amid the ongoing border tensions with China in the Gowan Valley of East Ladakh, India's ally, France has become the first country to offer India the support of its armed forces. As India stands up to Chinese aggression at the line of actual control in eastern Ladakh and considers military pushback against the dragon in case things escalate, New Delhi's defense allies are pitching in with arms and ammunition. From France to the US to Russia, the Modi government has got ubiquitous support. Russia will supply 1 billion US dollars worth of ammunition, including anti-tank guided missiles, and man portable air defense systems. Recently, Rajnath Singh had visited Russia to expedite the delivery of the S-400 anti-air defense system, the most powerful missile defense system in the world. Strike optimized and latest variant of the F-15E Strike Eagle multi-aerial fighter, F-15EX from Boeing has been offered to India which was confirmed earlier this year and now media reports confirm that state-owned Hindustan Aeronautics Limited and Mahindra Defense have also been roped in as partners if F-15EX is selected by Indian Air Force for its requirement of 114 fighter jets and latest tender. Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, HAL, and Mahindra Defense are also partners in FA-18EF Block 3 fighter jet which is also an offer to Indian Air Force by Boeing. F-15EX is from heavyweight class fighter like Sukhoi Su-30 MKI but it was offered to India in response to Russia being allowed to offer India for the first time Sukhoi Su-35 which too belongs to the same class as F-15EX. According to latest media reports, after France, US has come ahead and pledged military support to India in conflict with China. They said our military might stand strong and will continue to stand strong, whether it's in relationship to a conflict between India and China or anywhere else. Meanwhile, India and China continue to remain locked in a standoff in areas like Pangong Tso, Gowan Valley and Gagra Hot Springs in Ladakh. The tensions have heightened between the two countries after their respective army personnel clashed in Gowan Valley resulting in the death of 20 Indian troops.